you're an angler looking for a bivy or brolly that's quick to erect, then the Tempest range of shelters certainly tick that box. The Tempest's revolutionary freestanding design with its patented opening mechanism make it arguably the fastest rigid frame shelter system there is, but with a number of models in the range to choose from, how do you know which Tempest is right for you and your angling? In this video, I'm going to be taking a look at the six models which will make up the Tempest range as of March 2020, which sees the introduction of three new big and tall models which boast increased internal space for comfort during longer sessions including this one behind me, the Tempest 200, which is the first Tempest we've ever designed with more than a single occupant in mind. So, join me as I delve into some of the things you might want to consider when deciding which model of Tempest is for you. The Tempest range, as of March 2020, will feature the following shelters. Known previously as the Tempest Broly V2, the Tempest Broly 100 is a lightweight, compact Tempest for one angler, which can be transformed from a basic, rapid erect Broly style shelter into a full bivy system by utilising optional modular accessories. Next up, we have the Tempest Broly Advanced 100. Based on the compact footprint of the Tempest Broly 100, this feature-packed and versatile Tempest system for one angler comes complete with Aquatex fabric, adaptive ventilation, zip-in infill panel, quick sticks and ground sheet. Moving on, the Tempest Broly 100T is brand new for 2020, boasting increased headroom in this lightweight, compact Tempest for one angler, which again can be transformed from a basic, rapid erect Broly style shelter into a full bivy system by utilising the optional modular accessories. The Tempest Advanced 100 Bivy utilises the footprint of its predecessor, the award-winning Tempest V2 Bivy system to offer optimum space for one angler and luggage. This latest feature-packed incarnation comes complete with Aquatex fabric, adaptive ventilation, zip-in infill panel, quick sticks and ground sheet. The Tempest Advanced 150 is the bigger brother of the Tempest Advanced 100 Bivy, retaining all of its high performance features such as Aquatex fabric and adaptive ventilation, whilst offering additional room inside for increased comfort for one angler plus their luggage. The most recent addition to the range is the Tempest 200. It's the biggest Tempest to date, purposely designed to comfortably accommodate two anglers plus their luggage whilst retaining the key Tempest features of being incredibly quick and easy to erect. So, now you know which models are in the Tempest range, let's get stuck into the differences between the models in order to help you decide which one is best for your needs. Size and weight. As you may have picked up on from the names of the Tempests in our current range, here at Tracker we've started using a new size rating convention, similar to that used in the camping market, with shelters optimally designed for a single occupant and their luggage rated as a 100 size shelter. In turn, a 200 size shelter is optimally designed for two occupants plus luggage. A 150 size shelter sits in between the two as a spacious shelter for one angler with additional internal space for those who might want the extra comfort for when fishing longer sessions, for those who maybe like to take their dog fishing with them or just like the extra options that having additional room inside the bivy offers. Something to remember if perhaps you're going to be carrying or barrowing your gear a long way and you're looking to keep the overall weight of your setup down is the bigger the shelter is, the bigger the overall pack down size will be. And also, as a general rule, smaller shelters will be lighter than larger ones. The exception to this rule is the Tempest Broly Advanced 100, which comes in approximately 1.5 kilograms heavier than the Tempest Broly 100T, a factor which comes down to the extra features and accessories the Tempest Broly Advanced 100 has, and the fact that the Tempest Broly 100T is covered with our 210D fabric, which is approximately 18% lighter than our Aquatex, which is featured on all of our advanced models. I'll touch on more of the differences between our 210D fabric and Aquatex a little later in this guide, but that's just a rough idea of how they weigh up against each other. The Tempest Broly 100 and Tempest Advanced 100 Broly offer the most compact footprint of the shelters in the range, making them ideal for fitting into smaller swims or even tight spaces where there are no real swims or pegs to speak of, such as on rivers or canals. Their pat down size is compact too, coming in at a length of just 110 cm with an approximate diameter of around 23 cm, making them great if storage space at home or room in the vehicle used to transport you and your gear to your chosen water is a factor. 
and with a low profile they're also great for keeping stealthy when needed and literally hug the ground like a limpet in high winds although taller anglers might find the internal headroom of 125 centimeters a little restrictive if they find themselves bivy bound for too long however if you're looking for a rapid erect shelter for overnighters or day sessions where you'll be sat on a low chair or if you just find that you're okay with fishing longer sessions from a compact shelter and don't need any additional space then either of these shelters will tick those boxes for you and then some If you're a taller angler and find that the 125 centimetres headroom offered by the two Tempest Brollies I've just mentioned isn't quite enough for you, but you still require a shelter to have a compact footprint, be light in weight and have a relatively small pack down size, then the Tempest Brolly 100T with the T standing for tall is going to be worth a look for you. Offering an additional 25 centimetres in height while sharing the same footprint as the other two Brollies, the Tempest Brolly 100T makes fishing longer sessions from a compact shelter a more comfortable experience and also means anglers can enjoy using taller beds and chairs inside the shelter without their view of the water being compromised. Solo anglers regularly fishing longer sessions may require a slightly larger shelter still and if that sounds like you then the Tempest Advanced 100 and Advanced 150 bivvies are probably going to suit you better than the Brollies. These bivvies have larger but still economical footprints for the size offered internally and are just as quick and easy to erect as their smaller counterparts. Something new to the range of Tempest shelters this year is the first Tempest designed to be used by two occupants. So whether you like to go fishing with a friend, want to take your partner or child, or maybe just want the luxury of having all that additional space to yourself, then the Tempest 200 Bivy is going to eliminate all of the hassle associated with setting up a shelter of this size as it goes up in exactly the same way as all of the other Tempests, quickly. Ventilation. Good ventilation in a shelter is something that's often favoured by anglers through the warmer months but allowing air to flow through the shelter is also great for managing condensation all year round. All of the Advanced Tempest models feature four large insect mesh covered vents at the sides and rear of the shelter and these all utilise our adaptive ventilation system, meaning even if it's pouring with rain outside, they can still be partially open to allow airflow throughout the shelter without letting any water in. Plus, if you're using the supplied zipping infill panel, then there's a large mesh covered vent panel in the door, and the larger models also feature additional triangular shaped vents either side. The Tempest Brolly 100T and Tempest 200 Bivy also feature twin ventilation panels at the rear of the shelter, with the supplied zipping infill panel of the Tempest 200 Bivy also featuring a further three panels, and although these don't utilise the adaptive ventilation system, they're still a great feature to have if you're planning on using the shelter during the warmer months. Fabric. Here at Tracker, we take the fabrics we use to cover our bivvies and brollies seriously and independently test them in labs to recognise standards. All of the advanced models of Tempest, so that's the Advanced Brolly 100, Advanced 100 Bivvy and Advanced 150 Bivvy are covered with Aquatex. Now, technically Aquatex isn't even a fabric, even though we may refer to it as one. What it is, is a highly engineered technical composite designed to offer multiple benefits to the end user. This highly waterproof material is also breathable and hydrophobic and what that means in very general terms is that although the fabric won't let water pass from the outside in, it does allow for water vapour to pass through it and leave the shelter, reducing the effects of condensation. The hydrophobic part relates to the exterior coating of the fabric, which causes surface water to bead and roll off the shelter, allowing water vapour from inside to continue to permeate through the fabric unimpeded. Aquatex is also windproof, as due to its technical coating, it won't allow wind to pass through from the outside to the inside, so the user stays warmer and more comfortable when inside the shelter. The other Tempests in the range, so that's the Brolly 100, Brolly 100T and the 200 Bivy, are all covered in our waterproof and durable 210D fabric, which carries a massive 10,000mm hydrostatic head rating, so it's seriously waterproof. Two other factors worth considering in terms of the fabrics the Tempest range utilise are light permeation and weight. Aquatex is an opaque fabric, so it will be much darker inside an Aquatex shelter during the day, even during strong sunlight, than it would inside a shelter covered with 210D fabric. Worth considering if you're planning on fishing anything other than quick overnighters through the warmer months, where the shade provided by opaque Aquatex, combined with the adaptive ventilation system, will help to keep you cooler and more comfortable inside the bivvy. At the other end of the scale, if you'll mostly be fishing overnighters through the summer and day sessions through the cooler months, then you might want to consider a 210D shelter, as it will be brighter inside during the day than compared to an Aquatex shelter, although light permeation can be reduced by adding a dedicated Tempest school cap. Also, 
as previously mentioned, 210D is lighter in weight than Aquatex, which again is worth thinking about if overall weight is a crucial factor when choosing a Tempest Bivy or Tempest Brolin. Accessories. All of the Tempests in the range are customizable through the use of dedicated accessories, which in some cases will be supplied with the shelter and in others will be optional extras which need to be purchased separately. All models of Tempest Bivy or Brolly come supplied with a tension strap, T-pegs and a zipped carry bag. For Aquatex models, this will be a heavy duty NXG carry bag, whilst 210D models come with a lightweight yet durable carry bag made from the same material as the shelter itself. Ground sheets are highly recommended, not only to keep things clean and tidy inside your shelter, but they also provide insulation, help to reduce the effects of condensation and keep out drafts. A ground sheet is supplied with each of the Tempest Advanced models and also with the Tempest 200 Bivy. For the Tempest Broly 100 and Tempest Broly 100T models, ground sheets are available as optional extras. To swiftly transform a Tempest from open fronted shelter to a fully enclosed bivy with a two way zip door, zip in infill panels are also supplied with each of the Tempest Advanced Shelters and the Tempest 200 bivy, as are quick sticks, which can be used to add stability and rigidity, providing a rock solid setup. Both of these items are also available as optional extras for the Tempest Broly 100 and the Tempest Broly 100T. Zipping insect panels are available as optional extras for all Tempest shelters except the 200 and are used to provide protection from flying, biting insects while allowing for maximum ventilation without restricting the angler's view from inside the shelter. The dedicated zipping insect panels for the Advanced 100 and 150 bivvies feature a magnetic self-closure system, which as the name suggests, if you need to exit the shelter in a hurry to hit a run, the door opening snaps shut behind you, keeping bugs out whilst you're tending to a fish. Skull caps are also available as optional extras for all models of Tempest Bivy and Brolly, and using one has multiple benefits. Firstly, a skull cap gives the Tempest a peak, which helps to keep rain from entering the doorway of the shelter. A skull cap also provides a thermal layer on top of a Tempest to aid in retaining warmth during the colder months, as well as increasing shade in the warmer periods and also helping to reduce the effects of condensation inside the shelter. Tempest skull caps are easy to fit and can be left in place on the shelter when packing down and they all feature dual velcro rod straps to replace the ones on the shelter which are covered when the skull cap is in place. Inner capsules are available as optional extras for the Tempest Advanced 100 and 150 models as well as for the Tempest 200 bivy and also have multiple benefits. These can be quickly and easily fitted inside the shelter via a toggle system to create a fully enclosed inner compartment with a stitched in ground sheet which is perfect for keeping out unwanted guests such as rodents and insects. Plus, having a Tempest inner capsule fitted can dramatically reduce the effects of condensation inside the shelter. You'll also find that the capsules have a couple of handy pockets, giving you additional storage options inside the bivvy, which you can use to stash items such as your phone, keys, wallet, or to be honest, anything you want. A clear window is another optional accessory which can be added to almost all Tempest doors, with the exception of the Tempest 200 bivvy, which is supplied with a dedicated clear window to fit its oversized door. These are really easy to attach via Velcro, going over the insect panel in the door to allow natural light into the shelter on days when the weather is so bad that even letterboxing your bivvy door isn't really an option. That brings us to the end of our look at the Tempest range for 2020, and hopefully, by now, you should be fairly clear on the differences between all of the Tempest bivvies and brollies in our range, and the dedicated Tempest accessories available for them. We should make choosing which model is best suited to you and your fishing easier. If you want to drill down even deeper into the details of each individual shelter, then don't forget to visit the product pages on our website for each item, where you'll find thorough descriptions, all the specifications you might require, and videos for each model of Tempest. And if there's anything you're still not sure on after that, then feel free to ask any questions you might have in the comments below, and we'll do our best to answer as many of them as we can. Alternatively, come and pay us a visit at one of the many shows and shop open days we attend around the UK and Europe throughout the year where myself or any one of the team members will be more than happy to assist you in making the right choice. All that's left for me to say at this point is thanks for watching and if you're new to the channel and like what we're all about then hit that subscribe button to be amongst the first to know each and every time we upload new content. Catch you later!